Tokyo. And I just checked into my hotel, my APA hotel here in Tokyo. And I want to give you the tour. So it is not big, but it has everything. Okay, let's start here. Slippers. I guess I'm taking my shoes off them. Let's leave the bathroom for later. Here we've got a desk. Oh, and I'm hungry. Alrighty, and here in the drawer, what do we have? What do we have? Who do I get to keep this? Uh, with a belt. Oh, very nice. Here we've got little coffee things. Got a little fridge, we got a phone. And the bed. I mean, it's not huge, but it will do the job. And oh my God, you guys. After 18 days on a cruise ship without any movies or any watching TV, I am excited. Oh, look, they made me little birds. Do I have a view? Oh, I do have a view as well. I absolutely love it. I really love it. Okay, <clears throat> bathroom. If it has a bathtub, I'm gonna scream. This is the bathroom situation. Oh my God, we have a bathtub. Oh my God, it's really deep. Oh my God. I love this hotel. It's tiny, but I mean, look at everything. Everything, everything. Amazing. And so much to learn at the toilet. It's a Japanese toilet with the buttons. Here, there's the remote. I mean, guys, I am excited. I shall take this off. I haven't even taken anything off. And I will just live here. <laughs> very, very nice. Good morning, Tokyo. I'm in bed watching New York vlogs. And it's raining out there. Alrighty, Tokyo, let's do this. Are you ready, Tokyo? It's not very pleasant, but I'm out and on my way to breakfast. <laughs> Thank God the subway station is right there. apparently really good so and it only opens at 11 30 so i've been killing a lot of time and i'm starving and i need my tea i haven't had my tea yet and i'm in ginza i made it I'm trying not to get killed okay very fancy here i have to say i like it Here's my review for Ain Sof. It was absolutely amazing. It was worth the wait. I had to wait quite a bit because I didn't have a reservation. So make a reservation because the place is tiny. And the pancakes, oh my God. Really, really, really good. Not cheap, but worth the money. The tea was too small though. So now we're looking for just some simple tea at some maybe 
chain coffee house thing. And we are exploring Ginza, even though it's raining. Very nice here. I was about to do the unthinkable and go into Starbucks for a tea but then I saw that it says French tea over there so French is probably better than American Starbucks if I'm not to get killed so let's check that one out very fancy it's up there just pay $15 for a tea. I sure did, but it was delicious and it was a limited edition Japanese cherry blossom tea. And now we shall explore and maybe do some shopping. Ladies and gentlemen, Ginza. the rain has stopped the fog is lifting so maybe it's time to go to a park and not only do designer shopping even though they've got everything here and it's very tempting but I have behaved so far place to just hang with nice views as well. They've got a farm here on the roof of the shopping center. It's really nice the sun came out and it feels like spring now. Amazing! I was hoping to have some views up here. It doesn't really have views, but it's still a very nice spot. Well, I see some temples. And there's also a restaurant here. But I'm not hungry, I'm still stuffed for my pancakes. Beautiful flowers too. to go to Dior you have to line up and wait this is why I'm going to Abercrombie and Fitch, Fitch? Fitch. <laughs> this is a very interesting store they make you take the lift all the way up then you start all the way up and then then you go all the way down and there's lots of artwork interesting it's like a museum with clothes. <laughs> Such 
je suis content d'être là. Je suis content d'être là. Je suis content d'être là. from animals though unfortunately so I won't be shopping there for now hopefully there will be more coming at some stage because I really love those shoes and I thought they had vegan leather but man was I wrong apparently <laughs> I thought this was a pedestrian area because it looks like it and then I almost got killed and learned the hard way that it isn't <laughs> I'm still walking in the middle of the streets though I'm now heading to Hibia Park because it's beautiful now, it feels like spring and I want to touch the grass <laughs> after all the shopping OMG, there's an owl cafe Do they have real owls in there? Oh, I think they do Oh my god Okay, I have to have a look at the owl cafe It's reserved. Come after four o'clock, okay. I mean, I have to say it smells like owl. I never knew what an owl smells like, but I, now I know. <laughs> and maybe next time, but there you have it. If you want to pet an owl, this is where you're going. It is owl happening in Ginza. <laughs> very excited about the flowers here in Japan. in there that would be so amazing i mean i see water you never know anything is possible here in japan Alrighty, so we're looking for turtles and or cherry blossoms but we take any reptile as usual but turtles would be preferred here in the water nothing well, we will keep looking. And it's so hot all of a sudden. Cherry blossom, check. Very nice cherry blossoms. They're just getting started. Let's look for turtles or tortoises. I have very high expectations on this park. Oh my God, I found a robot. A robot tortoise. I might have to settle for the robot tortoise. But we'll see. The day is still young. Spring is in the air, what can I say? Turtles? Nothing. Oh my god, I see Austrian beer. Stiegel. Stiegel is Austrian. Not that I would drink it. But oh my god, is this an Austrian cafe? It's a beer terrace. Oh 
There you have it. If you want to try Austrian beer, come to Tokyo. Okay, there's a really high chance of turtles in this body of water. But so far nothing and they might still be hibernating. But there's only one way to find out. Actually, there's two ways. I can look and I can ask in Japanese because that's the only word I can say is kame, which means turtle. <gasps> there's one. Oh my God, there are two. Oh my God. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh, I'm team. I got it all. I got my turtles. days this really big one but that's a statue I almost had a heart attack I think there's a few statues in there as well but yeah also a few real ones So this park was a full success. We got everything we asked for and more, even Austrian beer. And now we are going to the next park, which is sort of connected. And we'll see what that one has to offer. Okay, so the next park has the Imperial Palace. Let's check it out. Smokers are a dying species here. Behind glass, you can see them only behind glass. Unfortunately, the parks here are like in Austria as well in some parks. You have to not walk on the grass. In Australia and in England, you're allowed to be on the grass, but here you just have to walk on the path and you must not step on the grass. I mean, I guess we can't have it all. We got turtles, so who needs grass if you can have turtles? Also, this park is massive and the castle is somewhere in there gonna be a long walk up to the castle so I have a feeling we can't really walk up all the way to this thing that's why people are standing here taking pictures so I'm doing the same okay I got my picture everything else is locked off so I think we will go back to all the shopping and restaurants if we have to This is so pretty. This is the Mitsubishi building and originally constructed in 1894, was the first office building erected in the Marunouchi district, Tokyo's financial center. There you have it. Red brick structure it was designed by the British architect Josiah Konda in the Queen Anne style. It was popular during the Victorian area. 41 years later, it has been given a new life and now it stands at the original site. So yeah, it's very modern now. I don't see the red brick, but ah, maybe there a little bit. Well done, well done guys. Thumbs up from me. Okay, so I'm not quite sure about the choice of name here. So name your soup curry switch. It might be amazing in there, so I'm not charging it. I'm just saying it might not be the best name. And I'm walking back to Ginza now to get myself a burger because it's a, a pancakes and burger sort of day. Why not? No 
shopping. I'm starving now. It's time for a burger. Okay, it's somewhere here. Okay, it's called Two Foods. Maybe I should get two burgers then. Where is it? Is it here? Oh, are they real? Found it! <laughs> Yummy but so healthy. Alrighty then. I love it already. So it's all very fancy and you order with QR. I'm starting with a healthy salad, then burgers and then ice cream. burger was so good i'm in love with it it's the best thing ever we will finish off this meal with this bad boy amazing dinner and this has like plants here as well so it's all about plants here and there's like a farm of plants and bonsai trees fresh towels and fresh cups outside instead of making up my room but I guess maybe that's just how it is anyway I made it I'm back home in my little hotel room and I will just have a bath and chill and watch TV alrighty guys I'm running my bath so this is it for me thank you so much for watching subscribing is free and would help me out a lot so i would really appreciate that if you didn't hate this video too much please give it a thumbs up more tokyo vlogs to come this was only day one there's two more days two more and many more trips around the world coming as well so i see you in the next one thank you guys bye, bye.